Hey everybody, it's Brandon from soldwithvideo.com and I'm going to show you guys real quickly how to use the Google AdWords Keyword Tool. So if you haven't found it yet, we can just go to Google and type in Google AdWords Tool. And there it is. So what we want to do is search for our first keyword. Um, the first one is going to be buy homes for cash or sell homes for cash. So let's just do sell homes for cash. And we want to make sure that exact is chosen instead of broad. You can actually do both if you want, but always choose exact because it will tell you how many times the exact phrase sell homes for cash is actually searched. Whereas uh, if something like sell homes for cash in Europe or sell homes for cash quickly or sell homes for cash now um, are searched in Google, that will all count under the broad category, which can give you false uh, numbers on how many times sell homes for cash is actually searched. But if you choose exact, it will show you exactly how many times sell homes for cash was searched into Google. So always make sure that exact is filled out. And as you can see, there is local monthly searches and global. Always go by local. It will give you a more accurate uh, number of searches um, for that keyword, whereas global is globally. So someone searching that in China, you know, would count under global and someone searching in China is not really going to help you out. So make sure that local monthly searches is always chosen. And you can see here that it's only searched uh, or under 10 times a month. Um, doesn't mean we'll necessarily count it out. It may still be a good keyword to put into your campaign. Uh, just because it will help you rank for other things. So if we start trying to get ranked for sell homes for cash, and we also start getting ranked for other keywords like Austin, uh, Texas, Austin, homes in Austin, Google will kind of see all three of those and kind of tell, t be able to tell that sell homes for cash in Austin may be another thing to rank us for. So um, what you can do is kind of go through the list here and see which ones have high competition, medium competition, and low competition, and you can see how many times they are searched every month on the right side here. So let's go through and see another keyword. Uh, since we're targeting the Austin and Dallas area, let's do homes for cash in Austin. Okay, so this one uh, has zero searches every month, but doesn't mean you should necessarily count it out. Just because it doesn't have any searches doesn't mean it's not being searched. Uh, Google just doesn't keep track of one or two searches and the fact that it doesn't have any searches according to Google could mean that it's a very low competition keyword which means it will be easy to get ranked for so this could be a good one to add in it may only get searched three four times a month but you know those are three or four potential people that could see the video um, and with very little work you could get ranked for it so just because it doesn't have any searches doesn't mean you should necessarily count it out so now we can kind of go down the list and see which ones would work for us and sort through them all. And you can just kind of pick and choose which ones you want. Uh, if you want to make sure that certain terms are included in the keywords that come up, you can type in that keyword here. So if we want keywords that only contain Austin to come up, we could just type in Austin. And then it will kind of filter out every word and make sure that everyone, every word that it recommends has the word Austin in it. Uh, so it's another way to kind of filter through the results here. Uh, here's one with low competition, but it's Austin Home listings, so it's not really going to help us out. Uh, I have a list here of ones I kind of quickly went through, and we'll kind of go over that uh, in a little bit. But you can see, let's do sell my house quickly. So sell my house quickly. We'll search for it has 140 searches every month. Uh, the competition is high, so this isn't always the best keyword to choose for, but again, it will help us get ranked for other keywords like sell my house quickly in Austin uh, or sell my house quickly in Dallas, which is why I added it to the list. Um, no keyword, oh, let's take that out. Okay, so now it gave us a whole list of other keywords that we can choose so can, you can kind of go through the list and pick and choose and uh, try to make a list kind of like what I did. And this is the search mount here. And these are other keywords that I'm going to try to get my video ranked for. These ones here are like the main ones that are going to be 
a little harder to get ranked for, but uh, they're going to be my primary keywords and will eventually help me get ranked for all these other keywords down here. Um, so I hope this helps you out and uh, be sure if you have any questions to go ahead and ask and post any comments. And uh, if you need to get a hold of me, you can visit me at www.soldwithvideo.com. Take care, everyone. Bye.